And hello again. In this video tutorial, we'll be showing you how to use the measuring tools in the tactical map on the uh, tablet MDT version of Streetwise CADLINK. Now, when you're in the tactical map, typically you're centered on the uh, on the incident itself. There are now two measuring tools available to you. You'll lo find those located in the map action menu. In the map actions menu you'll see measure distance and add circle. Now let's look at the measure distance tool first. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually zoom this map in a little bit. We'll kind of show you how this might be used in practical application. I'm going to add measure distance by clicking on this and then you'll see that we get a prompt that says tap on the map to add path waypoints to measure. Now the uh, unique thing about our measuring tool is that it, it is a multi-point uh, distance measuring tool. So in other words, instead of measuring simply as the crow flies, you can actually measure a route that would make sense. So let's say for instance from this incident we wanted to measure our route down to this hydrant located right here. But we can't just go straight because there's no way our apparatus would go that way. So we're going to take from this location, we're going to put our first dot right at the location, then we're going to come out to what we know is the driveway and we're going to come out to the main road and we're just dropping little points along the way we'll come all the way down to here into the entrance of the parking lot and over to the hydrant now you can see that we've actually laid out a logical route that our apparatus would be able to take from this hydrant to that scene the total measurement of all those points together is 205 yards. So we're measuring that distance but we're measuring it along a logical route and that is the multi-point distance measuring tool. When you're done making that measurement you simply hit tap to dismiss and that goes away. Now the other distance measuring tool we want to show you is the radius distance measuring tool. And again, we'll use a practical application for this. Let's assume at this incident point we had had a chlorine leak of some sort in the building and we wanted to evacuate outwards, uh, oh, say 100 yards from the building to make sure nobody was in that radius. So we'll come over to the map actions and we'll say add circle we get an uh, instruction that says tap and drag to add the circle and set the radius. So I'm going to put my finger down right on the building here and I'm just going to start dragging my finger outwards. I'm going to watch that measurement up at the top and you can see that I'm going to drag it out till I'm about a hundred yards out. Um, pretty close anyway. We'll drag it and stop there. And now you see that we have a 100 yard circle around that building and we're able to see what other buildings or what other uh, areas might need to be evacuated if we were trying to keep everyone out uh, of 100 yards uh, within that particular incident location. So that is our radius uh, measuring distance tool and those are both available from the tap tactical map actions menu in Streetwise MDTs.